Interesting, isn't it? Because we spoke with Simon Calder earlier. He said the big dream was about this legacy of United. Yeah. So, if you missed the Northern Lights, that was last weekend. You? Yes. Matt is listening in. He's on the weather in a second. Matt's is live now from Jerusalem. Um, a very good morning to you. This promise from the Israeli government to bring back every hostage. What do we know about the operation this morning? Uh, morning to you. More confirmed cases today. How is the community? in a lawsuit that was settled last year. Combs is at the centre of several civil lawsuits accusing him of sex offences. While Los Angeles, they were discovered following interrogations of terrorists. Our diplomatic correspondent, Paul Adams, joins us this morning from Jerusalem. Good morning to you. What more do we know about how the bodies were brought back? Esme Stallard is in Brixham for us this morning. Esme, good morning to you. A big leap in the number of confirmed cases. It's possible many more out there. We begin in Israel, where the military says it's recovered the bodies of three hostages who were killed by Hamas. Do you get a bruise? About and how people in danger, danger, danger communities are losing the better side there. Maybe Lovely. some of them at least might come back. Yeah, and there's a story inside the Times this morning about how pubs are adapting. Tell you what, the youth.